Welcome back. We pick up where we left off on our coverage of the 2013 STV Auto Rally Corporate Challenge. Now that you know a little bit more about the rally, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the action that took place. Participants of leg 2 of the 2013 STV ARCC congregated bright and early at the Ayala Harbor Point Mall in Subic. Made up of predetermined routes, Alpha Route had a distance of 61.7 kilometers that went through Subic Freeport and out to Bataan Techno Park looping back through Anvaya Cove and ending back at the Ayala Harbor Point Mall for a running time of 1 hour and 45 minutes. Beta Route, on the other hand, ran a total of 59.6 kilometers that went in and around the Subic Freeport Zone and likewise ending in the Ayala Harbor Point Mall for a running time of 1 hour and 35 minutes. After a short message from STV Chairman and CEO Ray Butch Gamboa during the flag-off ceremony, participants held their attention for speeches from Arnel Reniedo, brand manager of Chevron Philippines, with the racist presenting sponsor Derek Manuel, Deputy General Manager of Ayala Harbor Point Mall and Attorney Chot Kabigting, Deputy Administrator for Tourism of SBMA. We were able to catch up with them and a few others shortly after this to get a bit of what they had to say about the latest installment of the STV ARCC and how they feel about holding it in a place like Subic. We've been partners with STV for more than five years already. We've been supporting several of uh, STV's activities. Uh, we had a golf show earlier this year. We supported the this second leg and also the first leg of the rally. Primarily for Auto Rally, it's a shared advocacy between uh, Chevron or Caltex for that matter. We're advocates of road safety and uh, the theme around ARCC is that arrive on time, all the time. So we believe that there's a safe way of driving, you don't have to rush into things. And uh, that's a shared advocacy, that's why we're supporting ARCC. Actually moving into 2014, we were definitely looking into more activities, more partnerships with STV. For as long as we share the same advocacy of road safety, you can definitely see more from us. So watch out for our upcoming thematic campaign. It's a new campaign altogether. It's called the Five Star Fuel. So in a nutshell, it means one fuel, five benefits. Now, as to the details, just watch out for it. We'll be coming out really, really soon. First of all, um, we want to uh, have a partner with Mr. Butch Gamboa. And uh, of course, we saw the participants. That's the, also the, the market of Harbor Point. So that's why we really love them to have it here in Harbor Point. I'm looking forward to many more years of partnership with STV. Before, kasi, uh, we, we, me and partner Ro, uh, Mayor Roland, we, uh, we have a tandem going to the rally show, the car, car shows, rally, rally, auto rally, something like that. So, we're, um, I'm, um, I'm an enthusiast also, car enthusiast. I think this is a very appropriate event for Subic, considering that we have here traditional traffic rules that are to be observed by the, ra the participants of the rally, the contestants of the rally. It's all part of the event. Aside from that, we have a great layout and terrain that the drivers and their crews would enjoy. This is one place where they wouldn't have to contend with jeepneys and tricycles. Uh, I think this is the only place in the Philippines where you have public roads which are not congested with uh, buses and jeepneys and tricycles so it's really very suitable for purposes of the contest. Sa lahat po ng ating mga viewers, mga car enthusiasts, I'm inviting you to come to Subic and enjoy this place. It's totally uncongested, unpolluted and you can enjoy driving around and seeing the beautiful places that we have here. Come over and enjoy! It wasn't long after that before teams made their way to their vehicles, getting ready for a full day of being behind the wheel. 
The day the big event was held was split into two parts, a morning and an afternoon period for doing runs. Teams were assigned their routes for the morning and afternoon sessions and were deployed simultaneously to maximize on time and for a more efficient competition. Getting ready with maps, calculators, and a keen driving sense, the groups took off one by one to get the day started. An interesting and very integral component of this competition is how participants are required to follow all road rules and regulations. An infringement of the sort results in an automatic disqualification for the airing team. As a testament to what the competition stands for, none of the participants committed any road violations, ensuring that everyone was in line with the respect of the road and other motorists. This is truly one of the more unique features of this contest, aside from the on-time, all-the-time idea, making it one-of-a-kind experience for those who participated. After taking a midday breather, the competition continued on into the afternoon with more driving and more strategy. Striving to make perfect time to a pit stop along the route was the goal for each team and this is not as easy as it sounds. Between the driver, navigator and timekeeper, the communication must be clear. The driver must be a prudent motorist while listening to the detailed instructions of the navigator. As the timekeeper monitors the clock and keeps the group in check, it is really an exercise of both IQ and EQ, where the car is only a vehicle for the message of teamwork. And as a bonus, the competitors all come out much closer due to camaraderie after the race is over. Calling it a day, and as the last of the teams rolled in back to the Ayala Harbor Point Mall, the participants were tired but surely fulfilled in what was a day of pure motoring bliss. The competition is stiff and the race for the cup is on. In a little while, we'll hear from those who are right there in the thick of the action. We'll be right back with the coverage of the second and concluding leg of the 2013 STV Auto Rally Corporate Challenge after a short pause. Stay tuned, loyal viewers. We'll be right back. <laughs> 